the carnage. There you guys having a look at the perk big leagues. Hey guys, what's up? It's Robbie with Overworld Games. And yes, sports are a huge part of Fallout 4. So big, in fact, that this is actually going to be an achievement in Fallout 4. You've got something called the Home Run and Touchdown Achievement. Now, that sounds like that there could be many games in Fallout 4 that has not been confirmed. But what is more than likely is it's going to apply to finishers in the game. Melee finishers for those of you that are carrying around such things as baseball bats. And then also perhaps you can carry around or throw some sort of special grenade. Some sort of heavily modified football that can just take people's heads off. Who knows? But it's more than likely big leagues applies to finishers than actual mini games. But it really would be cool to see like some sort of a home run derby down the road. And yes, there are some other achievements that were revealed. I'm not going to be going into the mission-specific uh, achievements. If you do want to check out the story achievements, you can find those in the description below. But I'm going to try my best to keep this spoiler-free for you guys. So here we go. And remember, Megaton, did you nuke it or did you save it? Hmm. So like in Fallout 3, it might be you will be deciding the fate of the people as a whole as indicated by the prepared for the future achievement which states decide the fate of the commonwealth it sounds like you will be making a massive decision in the game much like you did in fallout 3 when it came to megaton and yes of course you could join the brotherhood of steel the minutemen and railroad in fallout 4 they're all going to be factions now this may grant you two special items in the case of the Brotherhood of Steel. I would think that would be the Vertibird that we have seen in many trailers. Joining the Railroad, on the other hand, may be more beneficial to trading between settlements as the achievement is called Tradecraft. And there will be other settlements within the game world, much like your own. You could decide to ally with them. What you are given by allying with them is still unknown, but we can speculate that you will be able to open up trade caravans. Of course, the trade caravans have been confirmed. I'm curious to see if there's some sort of fee or some sort of favor system related to actually allying with the settlements. I think there might be. However, I'm curious to see if you can attack or even steal from these settlements and take them over completely. Are you going to be evil badass? Let me know in the comments. And relationships. You got to get your love on in the wasteland. They will have their own levels as well. So it might be you could progress from first base, second base, third base, all the way to bang me base. And there is something called the hollow tape game, which may actually relate to memory din as well. It sounds like some sort of VR type thing. Perhaps you can relive amazing moments from Boston's history. Mm. And another achievement hints at abnormally large creatures that you can hunt down and kill. Kill five of these giant creatures and earn yourself some achievement award. And there's also something called Ranger Cores. This is some sort of investigation mission that involves 100 locations. Whoa, so it sounds like there's going to be a ton to do in the world of the Boston Wasteland. Cannot freaking wait. You guys have no idea. I know you guys are extremely excited for this game. I think it's one of the most anticipated games of the year for me alongside Star Wars Battlefront. Cannot wait to play this as my ultimate single player experience of this year. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you want more Fallout 4 and open world gaming goodness. And we are about to hit 300,000 subscribers very, very soon. That is mind boggling. So thank you guys for sticking with me. Seriously, I'm starting to really feel attached to my community and recognizing all of you out in the comments. So I will see you guys in the wasteland on November 10th. See you guys there. I'll be the dude eating human flesh. Yummy.